Storm Shield weather, certified most accurate. Good Saturday evening, everyone. I'm Storm Shield meteorologist Brandon Woolley, and your current temperature right now in Tulsa at 45 degrees. It was a slow climb out there for today, but eventually we did make it into the 40s. Despite all of that cloud cover, the south winds today really propelled our high temperatures into the 40s. We saw those gusts today anywhere between about 25 and 30 miles per hour. So no real weather system is marching through green country at this time, so all is quiet right now on double Doppler 2, though we're expecting a little bit of precipitation to fall tomorrow on your Sunday and then better chances on the way for the mid to latter part of this next week on your latest seven day forecast. Now in Broken Arrow, your current temperature at 44 degrees. Temperatures for tomorrow afternoon actually jumping up into the 50s to close to 60 degrees. Bartlesville now cool at 44 degrees, also into the mid 40s around prior. I have 43 in Bristow and also into the mid 40s for our viewers in Muskogee. Now reporting 46 degrees here at the 5 o'clock hour. And it's been quite gusty out there. We saw those winds really start to crank up for the morning hours and then maxing out during the afternoon. The wind is going to stay with us folks overnight tonight through tomorrow. The official daytime high today at the Tulsa International Airport was 46 degrees below the average high temperature for this time of year and it wasn't too bad last night actually down to about 35 degrees. It didn't drop too much because of the persistent cloud cover last night and also the winds pulling out of the south between about 5 and 10. So the real cold air is up towards the north Minneapolis now at 11 above 6 above in South Dakota. Another cold blast of air is coming for us for the mid to latter parts of this next week. You can see on the radar and satellite no radar echoes out there yet but watch Watching for some light rain showers or drizzle to develop by early tomorrow morning across green country. But that low stratus deck, the stratus clouds really thick out there still right now. Timing things out on future track clouds and precipitation. So early tomorrow morning, this is at six o'clock in the morning, a chance for some light rain showers or some drizzle. Those showers will be marching around even throughout the afternoon, especially over towards, I would say, northwestern Arkansas, far eastern Oklahoma, mostly cloudy to cloudy skies for tomorrow. But then we're expecting clearing tomorrow night and then sunshine comes back for your Monday forecast and temperatures cooler on Monday. So still wind out there overnight tonight gusting up to around 20 to 30 miles per hour. So breezy for the Christmas parades out there for early this evening and still some wind in our forecast for tomorrow to end the weekend. And then actually the winds turning up towards the north for later tomorrow afternoon and early in the evening. Overnight lows tonight dropping off into the upper 30s to right around 40 degrees. So not a big drop tonight, mostly cloudy to cloudy skies. Again, breezy to windy conditions. Wagoner only falls off to about 40 degrees. I have Tahlequah at 38, gusting up to around 30 miles per hour with mostly cloudy to cloudy skies. So let's time out your day for tomorrow on your Sunday. Chance for some light rain showers or drizzle early in the morning and still a chance for showers by the afternoon, but warmer into the mid to the upper 50s. I have Sky Took at 58 degrees, a chance for some rain showers, gusting up to around 30 miles per hour. And initially south winds, but then later tomorrow afternoon, especially early in the evening, switching up to out of the north, gusting up to around 25 or 30. And in some cases to the south of Interstate 40, into the 60s. So here's a look at your latest seven day forecast. A break in the weather for Monday and Tuesday down to about 44 degrees on Tuesday. Chance for a little bit of a wintry mix coming in for Wednesday, a break on Thursday, and it looks pretty active by next Friday and Saturday. You know, we have all those parades going on. We were talking about this earlier. It'd be beautiful, like nice weather, right. but the wind is brutal. Yeah, I mean, it did warm up today, but with the wind chill, it's actually down into the 30s, even though the observed temperature is in <laughs> yeah. the 40s. All right, well, thank you. <laughs> yeah.